In the previous video, I was talking about using multiple uh, seven segment displays, and I have done so, as you can see here. Well, I could do uh, this um, use uh, separate segments and wire them together and drive that, but it seems uh, a bit of a work. So I have another kind of display. As you can see, uh, this single board uh, contains three digits and they are uh, internally uh, connected. So all the A to uh, F, uh, G, all A to G segments of all the digits, all three of those digits are interconnected. So let's say A segment of this digit is also connected with this uh, digits A segment and also this ones. So they it just the p A pin is just brought as as one, and you have the common pins brought out. So whichever common pin you provide ground or VCC is the one that lights up. And um, I would use this, but. Uh, let's just talk about the problem here. This is the pin diagram of this one, and I also have a pin diagram on my laptop. And as you can see, uh, there's just uh, um, twelve. Are there twelve? Yeah. Uh, uh, 12 pins brought out and as you can see they have just brought out 1A 1B to all the uh, segments so there's only 1A only 1B pin and only 1D pin and so on to G uh, to F, uh, G and uh, they have one common pin for digit 1, this is digit 1, digit 2 and digit 3. Now this type of uh, display it's a um, common cathode so you provide uh, let's say uh, if I provide uh, D1 pin 12 here as you can see 1 to 6 and then 7 to 12 and um, if I power this on, what I need to do is provide, uh, since this is common cathode, I need to provide ground here. And if I uh, provide VCC uh, through a resistor to A, then the A segment, this top right one, A segment lights off of the digit 1. And if I switch to uh, D2 here, if I provide uh, ground here, the second display lights on. The second, uh, the A segment of the second display lights up. So this is how you toggle between digits. And we're gonna we we just have to use just seven pins to drive the segments and. Three pin, three pins to toggle between the digits. Uh, but I found another one. This is the one. Oh, I forgot to talk about the problem. The problem is the eighty eighty nine S fifty can only sync current. So as you can see, A in order to uh, light up segment A, I have to provide uh, positive voltage on A but I can't do that with my 8089S52 because it only can sync current so we will we wish we need common anode type of uh, display but I'm gonna use this with 4511 so this time I used this pin uh, this seg uh, seven segment display it's a two digit uh, seven segment display and I couldn't find any pinout for this uh, on, on uh, online 
so I just uh, mapped out the pinning and what uh, this is quite a, um, unusual layout because this one remember this one had all the segments uh, internally connected so a of this segment of, was also connected the pin the pins of these segments were uh, common and brought out as one so there's only one a but not this is not the case with this one because this one has separate a b c and so on so why would you do that i don't know if you decided to make a board that contains two digits why don't why won't uh, why won't you internally connect them that would be easier anyway so they have brought out all the segments separately so a1 is the a segment for first display and let's say d2 is um, the d segment of uh, digit 2 and this is quite interesting let's see this this has a bit of a symmetry if you can tell g1 and here's g2 and a1 and here's a2 and so on and these two are the supply pins so if you put VCC here and ground here uh, the D segment of display one will light up and if we put VCC here and a ground here then the D segment of the second display the digit 2 will light up so uh, I just uh, placed it on a breadboard and connected all these segments so C1 and C2 are connected E1, E2, D1 to D2 G1 to G, uh, G1 to G2 and so on and I've just uh, commoned all the uh, segments and brought them out so I'm just using seven pins and I'm toggling these uh, to display a specific digit on the first display or the second display so if I want to uh, display 12 so 1 and 2 uh, I will uh, set this one to VCC and 1 would show up and if I toggle to the D2 then I'll get the uh, second digit which is two, 2 in case of 12 and uh, I don't want to use separate pins for all these so I commented them and I'm toggling D1 and D2 to uh, display both digits now this is I uh, this I did with multiplexing now what is multiplexing uh, this is a technique where you uh, switch between the digit digits so fast that the human eye can't tell that they are being switched. Um, this technique is done by rapidly switching between adjacent digits, so only one digit is lit, lit at any one moment, but the microcontroller switches between the digits so rapidly that uh, you can't tell that they are being switched so let's say if uh, I want to sh uh, show 1, 2 and 3 the microcontroller will put 1 here then rapidly switch to this display and show 2 and then switch to this display and show 3 and go back to 1 again and this is done so rapidly that you can't uh, tell that it's being switched on and off so I'll talk about the software and the multiplexing uh, technique um, on the next video. Thanks for watching.